Hello to everyone, I am Bhuvita Devi. Hello everyone, I am Gayatri. Now we are going to explain about Pascal's triangle. It's an arrangement of number in a triangular array in such a way that number 1 is at the end of each row and the remaining numbers are the sum of two nearest number in the above row. For example, if we take number 2, it is the sum of two, two nearest number in the above row that is 1 plus 1 is 2. This Pascal triangle was named by a French mathematician in 17th century named Blaise Pascal. But he was so late, it was first named by a Chinese mathematician in 11th century named Jian Xian. So here we are going to learn about the properties of Pascal triangle. This Pascal triangle is a symmetric triangle. In this triangle, the starting point and the ending point of each row is always 1. If you add the, if you add the numbers in each row, the numbers for the rows gives us the power of 2. And if you see from the left side to right side, you can observe that this triangle represents the power of level. And, and this triangle forms a two diagonals. In the first triangle, diagonals forms a natural number, and the second diagonals forms the triangular numbers. Thank you. Now I'll say the uses of Pascal's triangle. Pascal's triangle is used in probability, combinatorics, algebra, and used for make, making pyramids, etc. Firstly. How it is, I will say how it is used in probability condition. Pro Pascal's triangle is used in various probability conditions. If I am tossing a coin, what are the possible outcomes that I will get? That is either head or tail. Suppose if I am if I'm tossing two coins, so I will get two outcomes. That is tail, tail, head, 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 tail or tail, head. Likewise, if I am scrolling uh, the rotating arrow, it focuses number 20. What are the possible outcomes for getting 20? That is 10 plus 10 is equal to 20, 10, 15 plus 5 is equal to 20 and so on. Secondly, combinatorics. Combinatorics is the mathematical counting and arranging. It is the study of finite discrete structures. Here also probability plays an important role that suppose if four cars are moving randomly on four paths, each car can move in all the four paths but not at the same time. What are the possible way that each car can move? That is 1 by 4. I will say its formula that is probability of car is equal to total number of car divided by Total number of car moved in each path. So we will get 4 by 16. The answer is 1 by 4. Third, it is used in algebra. Pascal's triangle is used in binomial expansions and to identify some um, answers in binomial expressions. Do you all know some formulas which is related to algebraic expressions that we will get from this Pascal's triangles is also a new fact to you. For example, a plus b whole, whole power 0 is equal to 1. a plus b whole power 1 is equal to 1a plus 1b. What are the coefficient of a and b? That is 1 and 1. a plus b whole power 2 is equal to 1a plus 2ab plus 1b. Here coefficient of a, a, b and b is 1, 2 and 1 and so on. And here the Fibonacci sequence by adding the diagonals of each row, each row the Fibonacci sequence are obtained.